Let me outline for you one of the most effective ways to close out the 10th win this week. First, try to get an early lioness. If you can't find early lioness, just pivot into stegosaurus. Whichever pivot pet you use, buy into a leopard, lionfish, and wolverine. Trust me, try it out, and let the build speak for itself. There'll be some fussy birds. They're always just squawking at you, you know? Like, chill, dude. You don't know me. Okay. Ooh, I love it. Groundhog, roll me another groundhog. Oh hell yeah. Okay. Straight up. I'll take a level 3 bunya. That actually goes really hard in the late game. Or I guess middle game, I should say. I don't know about late game. Ooh, off by one. That hurts. Not that much though. Let's be honest. Okay, I like it. We go here, freeze you, see if we got anything good. I sleep on the basilisk. Who needs him? Not I. Okay, maybe we should uh, have <laughs> gotten the basilisk. Ooh, we get a level though. Dog sheep. Take a sheep. Run something like this. We're almost at the level three. All right. See, that's what I was picturing happening the last ten rounds. Why aren't we winning more? <laughs> Let's go, Pegasus. Grab a little Easter egg on you, maybe. And then another one on you. Ooh, we get our level three. That's huge. Oh, dude, we're cooking. We're cooking up a heckin' storm out here. <laughs> oh, baby. That feels so strong. I love it. Alright, level me. Into a deer, dude? Come on. You can't make this up. This is too good. Alright. Straight up. Give me some more Easter eggs. Give me some more food dogs. We're full send in this. Not even close, brother. Nice try. Alright. We go here. We roll. Cockatoo is interesting. Not very, though. We gotta get rid of the sheep before we start doing something like that. I think we're rolling here. Platypus? Yo. It's gotta happen. I'm sorry. Kill me. Pegasus, maybe? Okay. If we got a pill, I would have done the tar. Maybe. But we did not, so I'm not. Dude, we're just doing work on these guys out here. <laughs> the turkey's got nothing on our pegasus. But I will immediately pivot to a turkey if given the opportunity. Just want to make that perfectly clear. Alright, well the sheep's probably got to go. Do we care about a cow right now though? We don't have the guys that we're really hard selling for. Maybe we don't yet. You know, maybe we just wait. We really, we're looking for tier 5, we're looking for tier 6. We're just kind of chilling for now. Ooh, This bus is gonna hurt. We're okay. Love it. Love it. 
All right, we go here. We go here. Ooh, yes, please. Don't care. We roll. Dude, why is turkey so strong? <laughs> He's a level one turkey and it's just broken beyond repair. Ooh, we found the lioness though. That's huge. Lioness me. Throwing an Yggdrasil. As soon as we find a turkey, we're online. It's always a question of who can find the turkey first, you know? That's just how it be. I don't make the rules, I just live by them. We go here. Mushroom is very good. Level me. Don't think we care that much about these. Are we going for like a big old deer? Probably not. Ooh, another lioness? I mean... I'll entertain the possibility. Linus kinda cooked. Loki. It's a turkey. <laughs> this is not gonna end well. Dude, I swear every time. Just give me turkeys, please. Is that so much to ask for? Um, let's see, how do we want to do this? We go turkey. Um... Maybe we do this... Into... A mimic, perhaps? Okay. I'll bite. So we're wasting some summons. Alright, well that kind of sucks. <laughs> Turkey's OP though, so I think we're okay. Yeah. Level 1 turkey. Goaded. Alright, we go here, we go here. Um, I think we do this. I was really hoping we get one of these two here. Bit unfortunate. Oh, dude, this guy's kind of cooking. All right, we lose that one. But we're gonna have a ton of gold coming up here. I guess he's only level one, isn't he? <laughs> Whoa, we got four gold. <laughs> All right. Um, the smart play would probably be to pivot into a leopard stegosaurus. A little snipe combo here. Oh, yes, I forgot. Go leopard, we go stego. Now we gotta get the stegosaurus attack up a bit. So he'll go before the leopard goes. Um, to do so, I'll give you some lasagna to start. I, I think we do this here. Just to get us through this particular turn. Love it. Perfect. And now we're looking for like a lionfish, I think. Uh, we can 
go here. Roll me. There's the lionfish. So we're hoping that the stegosaurus hits the lionfish here. Not the leopard, because leopards can use his ability already. Still at the leopard, unfortunate. Um, but I don't think it's gonna matter. These guys are kind of insanely huge. <laughs> the late game pivot is where it's at. This is like the ideal pivot. You throw in a bunch of lioness until you get these guys pretty big. A couple stegosaurus here and there. See some pouting bubbles. Anyone watch Powerpuff Girls? You know what I'm talking about. Not quite how I expected that fight to pan out, but it worked well in our favor. And let's go here. I don't think we care about those. Okay, I'm running like this. We're trying out something a little different today. Doing an early level up. See how that does for us. Um, Suchinoko, Basilisk, roll me another one. I could maybe run a dog. Maybe, maybe. With a health potion. Dude, that guy is huge. <laughs> Ogo Bogo B question mark. I might try one myself. We'll see. Oh yeah, dude. We're cooking. We're cooking with oil now. Another Ogopogo? Don't mind if I do. Maybe Ogopogo's like the goat. The hidden goat. Guy's running a magpie? Come on. That's just silly. So silly that it worked. <laughs> Okay. I think we roll here. Gotta make some sort of pivot here. I'm not sure into what. Maybe worms. Do this. Here into a deer. It's okay. We're getting stomped out here. This is painful. Alright, hard pivot incoming. You're running like this. We go here. Honestly. Alright, get rid of you. Let's just get this deer cooking. He's gonna be our champion. Ooh, I like Hippocampus here. I think we're gonna get rid of the dog. Maybe we can get a bunch of Hippocampus cooking. I'm telling you, dude, I have never once seen that that build actually work. <laughs> this might be biased, you know. Maybe it's just me. Sample size is admittedly low. But, like, come on. Not even once. Bu. 
bus doing work out here. I'm loving the bus build. Then we go here. I think we can run it like this. Go cow into deer. Just keep cooking our deer up. As soon as we can get a good um, tier 6, like a lionfish or something, I think we're gonna fail on the scaling the deer strat. This is doing good for us. Okay, we go here. I'm gonna do the, the most insane thing ever and not buy the turkey. Garlic me. Let's get this worm cooking. How much is it gonna take to get the worm to level three? Oh dude. I wish I had that many lion lioness right now. That'd be the dream. Okay, well we found a leopard. Well, that's a start at least. Ooh, another leopard. Don't mind if I do. I don't think we really care about this guy that much. We're getting the turkey treatment. <laughs> Turkey's too good. Okay. Get rid of the hippocampus, not before we use our better apple, of course. Hmm, we roll. Found a lioness. Is it too late though? I think it might be. I'd love to, but it, it feels a little late. A couple turns ago, I would have said, heck yeah, let's do it. Not anymore. But we are cooking. We're on eight wins. Can we pull it together? We need a solid late game pivot if we're going to pull this one out. Come on. Where are you at? Worm, sure. Not what I was hoping for. That was a fantastic snipe, thank you. <laughs> this is how you take out the turkey teams. Just get lucky. Okay, well you are definitely a part of this. I think we just go here. No, I feel like we gotta roll. Put you here. See if we can roll into something nasty. We did not. We did not roll into anything even remotely nasty. <laughs> well, let's see. Got the snipes on us. You hate to see it. That was a bit of a rough. I mean, we would have won that, just for the record, if our Stegosaurus didn't get sniped. Just want that to be known. But, yeah, we didn't get any good pivots into late game. I know I've said before that I don't think the Bunyip is very good. But <laughs> we're running the Bunyip again. I mean, how do you not with that setup, right? And this is how the tennis balls typically go. You don't do a damn thing. Alright, ferret part two. Refresh the tennis ball. Do a double cricket. Yeah, this is not gonna end well. <laughs> I don't have a good feeling about this. Oh wait, hold on. It's all coming together. He bought a mouse? Alright, we're good. This is why you don't buy mice, kids. Ooh, food dog. Uh, 
I guess we combine here. I think Ogopogo is kind of slept on a lot of times, to be honest. Dude, this, <laughs> this tennis ball actually though, it's going kind of hard. Do it again. Um, do we want a balloon this time? I'll try it. I'll give it a go. See what we can do. Go here, roll me. I think we're just rolling here. Another Ogopogo? Just combine. Let's not get crazy here. Look at that Ogo Pogo, making all the difference. And we draw. We'll take it. Alright, can I get some more Foo Dogs, please? Any Foo Dogs hanging out here? Ooh, hello? I mean, how do you pass up a deer here, you know? It's a trick question, you don't. But I definitely will... Get this eel cooking. Don't don't think I won't, because I will. And now the bus just el eliminates everybody. Just going hard. Ooh. The eel's getting kind of thick. And some garlic. Yo. Alright, this we're cooking. This guy is impossible to take out. Except for when he gets taken out. But before then, he's like totally impossible to take out. Uh, I'll give you an Easter egg, maybe? No. I don't think so. Not yet. And you're straight up not existing here in like a few turns. Roll me. Ooh, found a food dog. Me another food dog, please. Alright, I'll settle. I'm not going to be happy about it. Oh baby, we're cooking. Big eel taking us to the top. Until he falls off, eventually. Alright, found a deer. That's solid. I think it's about time you go. Let's get... Get a tinderbox laying down. No, thank you. Throwing a tar. Why not? He's bussing me. Great bussing. Alright. Well, the food dog was ready. He was totally ready to go. if I do. That's exactly what we're looking for. That's the key to our late game pivot. Maybe try throwing in a mimic here. Could be good. Alright, I still think I like our positioning here. The garlic is just doing wonders. It is so, so effective against summons. I love it. Not that that's news to anybody, but it's true. Okay. Do we care about the tar enough to wait for a level? Or for a pill, I should say. I don't think so. I'd say we throw in... Get an Easter egg on you. Roll me. Yeah, let's get rid of you. Or do we get rid of the Ogo Pogo? Is he doing anything? That's what we gotta ask ourselves. He's giving 2-2. Two, two. Yeah, dude, straight up, we don't even need you. What am I thinking? Do that. I'm glad I hit the deer and not the tar. That would've been sad. And then let's do it like this. 
I still want to get the eel cooking. Ow. <laughs> we will always lose to a turkey build. That's just how it is. Until we get to like our super late game. Um, we could run a leopard maybe. Leopard ain't bad. Roll me. There's the turkey if we want it. Uh, no food because we have lioness. There's no need for food. We should run the turkeys. Roll me once. I know they're not doing a whole lot right now, but even just the, the turkey on the rabbit is so strong. Good hits, good hits. Fantastic. Ooh, not enough. Not enough for the eel. Another lioness. Ooh. Alright, you're not doing a whole lot, so I think we can get rid of you. If I get a third lioness, dude, I'd be so happy. <laughs> we would be cooking. Roll me. Roll me. Oh, baby. Alright, full send. I don't care if we end a few rounds. I'm in it for the long run. And this is how we get to the long run. This feels r ridiculous. Okay. So now, holy moly, okay. We go here. We go Wolverine, roll. We gotta get rid of this deer. What are we gonna get rid of him for? Another lion. That's a great idea. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Um, we should probably find a leopard here soon, huh? That might not be a bad idea. Alright. Now we have to pivot into like something good, I think. I think that's generally what we gotta do. Alright, give me a level. There it is. I mean, the leopard's not doing enough to warrant keeping him here. I say we do something like this. Keep the chocolate frozen. Surely this is enough, right? Just barely. <laughs> Not by much. But it got there. We're good. Okay. We gotta keep pivoting here. That's how we win these. Um, How do we want to do this? There's, these aren't good enough. Roll me. There's our leopard. I think we combine here. Run a leopard here. <laughs> I'm trying to think the best way to set this up. Wolverine can probably go. Does he double this uh, this amount? How does that work? Sure. Okay. Let's assume he doesn't for a second here. We'll run a Spinosaurus. Basically just because it has a lot of a lot of oomph to it. Okay, they got a 50-50 chilling back there. We're gonna have to keep that in mind. We get through it. We're cooking. <laughs> the late game lioness pivot is coming through. Alright, we don't even care about chocolate, high key. Um, we do care about a wolverine. Thank you. Um, Roman. Another leopard. Sure. 
Roll me. I'll get rid of this lioness if we need to. Nerikabe. It'll be our, our stone wall. Keep us in the game, you know? Alright. I like where we're at here. I feel like this is a good late game pivot here. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> Come on, somebody hit the turkey, please. This is getting a little bit ridiculous. Jesus. We had so many snipes and none of them felt like hitting that turkey. <laughs> this is the whole point of you leopards. Well, that just goes to show. Lion as late game pivot is where it's at. Well, thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I will catch you all in the next one. Have a good one.